For the work we need the stabilized donor blood, laboratory dish, standard sera of the first, second, third and fourth blood groups of two different series, the isotonic solution of sodium chloride, slides and cotton wool. Put the small drops of the standard sera of the first, second and third groups into the cells on this dish. Use two different series of the standard sera of each blood group. So you will have six drops in total. Near these drops, put the small drops of the blood 10-20 times smaller than serum. Mix these drops of serum and blood with the help of different corners of slide. Shake the dish. Put it on the table within one minute. After that, tilt the laboratory dish to and fro in various directions during four minutes. The whole procedure is continued during five minutes. After that, add a drop of physiological solution of sodium chloride into every blood drop for destruction of false agglutinations. Shake the dish. Estimate the presence or absence of agglutination in each cell. If there is agglutination with the serum of the first and second blood groups, then the blood group is the third. If there is agglutination with the first and third serums, then the blood group is the second. If there is no agglutination, then the blood group is the first. When the result is positive in all the cells, the result of sample blood with the standard serum of the fourth blood group is held. Put the drop of this serum into the seventh cell of the dish and a small drop of the blood near it. Mix the drops. Repeat all procedure. If the result is negative, you may make conclusion that the test blood belongs to the fourth group of the AB0 system.